Hi everyone, so this is a video about my latest haul. So I've been um, shopping around, having a look for some different makeup products, um, some budget makeup. So just going to test them out compared to some of my other makeup because I'm sure that uh, lately I've been trying some nail products that are on a lower end of the scale price wise and they've been really good so I thought I would try some different makeup as well. So um, the first things I will show you and now I look at this it's not really low end but anyway I got these on sale. Uh, this is Revlon Matte and it is Tempting Teal. Revlon is not, um, oh god, I don't know whether this is going to work in the light. Oh yeah, there we go. Tempting Teal. Revlon is not um, a cheap brand in Australia. Um, we actually pay quite a lot for it. What is this? Uh, aubergine. So this is not normally um, one that I would, oh come on, work your magic. No, well, not one that I would normally buy, Revlon, but... There you go. Um, I found this discount um, makeup warehouse that had that. Then this is also by Revlon. It's called Make a Sheen and it's in Olive It Up. And I just really like the colours. I saw this one first actually. All the colours in that. It's beautiful. I love that. Then moving on to bronzers because we're coming into summer finally. Yay. Models prefer bronzer in a million bucks. Then I've got a concealer also from Models Prefer. Well, it's an anti-wrinkle concealer, which is what I need. And it comes in light. It's there. Then also, um, is this from BYS, a lip gloss and lipstick. And this is in Nearly Nude. So that's the lipstick there, if you can see the colour of that. And that's the, the lip gloss in my shocking lighting. Okay, then moving on to kind of a before and after thing. So this is BYS Face Primer with Vitamin E and Chamomile Extract. So that's the before. And then after you want to take your makeup off. So I've got Dove Foaming Makeup Remover. Which I've never used a foaming one before. So be interesting to see how that works. Then more into the makeup. Chi Chi Eye Magic. Now this is a different kind of makeup. This is more of a gimmicky type thing. You actually place the strip on your eye with the makeup and then wipe the eyeshadow on, off, sorry, off the strip onto your eye. And then hopefully your eyes will look like this, which is Pretty Purples. Now I don't know whether this is an Australian brand or not, and I've used the eyeshadows before and they're pretty good, but I mean, honestly, it's just a gimmicky thing. I just want to say, so got that. Then these are actually on the lower scale as well. Is there exhibit? And this eye palette is in dark. That's the colours there. You can see them. And then I also got it in bright. And I hope that wasn't one of the eyeshadows that just fell out. Now, honestly, I don't know whether I would ever wear that, but you never know. So, that's those. And I don't even think that was $10 for those. Really cheap. I don't know anyone who's tried that brand. Uh, so, it would be good to give that a go. Then, moving on to more makeup from um, BYS. This is the bronzer pack that I got. You can see there. So, it's the bronzer, then a lip duo which is in vanilla and chocolate, double-ended lip gloss. I basically just bought it for the lip gloss because I loved it. And then an eyeliner down the bottom. Then moving on to nail products. I know everybody's tried these, but I haven't tried them yet. It's the Sally Hansen uh, Nail Strips in Laced Up. You can see that. Then these are the cheap alternative. And if you can see these, they are skull and crossbones. I don't know, the pattern's a bit busy, but that's kind of the only decent one they had. And then that shows you the different patterns on the back there. And these are actually, they're by Nail Patch. And they're like nail foils, that's what it says on the back. Nail foils, so they're more of a sticker. Then, um, uh, as I said, we're coming to summer, so I wanted to try some more of the bronzers and things. And I wanted to try the Sally Hansen leg makeup, but they're actually out of that. So I got the Latan Flawless Legs and Deep Bronze, and it's a wash-off leg makeup. So that's it there. 
And moving on to nail polish, um, where I buy my all in nail polish from, the um, chemist is actually no longer going to be continuing the all in line, which is disappointing. I'm going to have to buy the line now, but anyway, they had a sale, so I bought a couple from there the last time I'll be able to buy them in person. So, this is all in, so a two pack here in the top to bottom and in La Playa. It's a blue, I don't know whether that's going to show up you guys there we go and then just a couple more from Ollie which this is a really hot color for summer Oh Cabana Boy a lovely hot pink which looks like it's coming up orange but it's not orange then two more in starry eyed and this has got more of a greenish tinge to it which is why can I never find the names to these things limelight there you go Then just a couple more here from BYS, which is um, Steal the Limelight. Um, I can't wait for the middle of summer to put that on. It's a beautiful lime green, like a pina colada. And then matte royal blue, which I actually had this on my nails last week. And then this one is Your Hired. I don't really wear a lot of pinks, but this is like a pink shimmery. It's a really nice colour. Then just a couple more here that I've got. This is Astralis and like I said I don't really wear pink so this is in Sensuality. And then have blue again. But it's a different blue. It is a Denim Dash. That's it there if you can see the blue. And then the last couple. Lemon Sorbet by Face of Australia. And then I love these little mini Maybelline ones. I think they're so cool. Uh, this is in Peach Cocktail, which is a lovely orange with a shimmer through it. Then a BYS. But this is in the Nail Art, so it's a little one. I wish I could have got it in full size, but they didn't have it. Uh, this is a mauve, isn't it? Metallic light purple. So it's probably coming up silver, but there is purple in there. Then, last but not least, because this is my favourite one that I've got um, this week, which was um, OPI, and I managed to find somewhere that sells it for half the price compared to what I have been paying for it previously. She doesn't have a huge amount, but still, it's better than nothing. This is from the uh, Miss Universe collection, and this is actually called uh, Crown Me Already. And I have this actually on top of um, the... What is it? Matte Royal Blue. I had these two together last week, or this week just finished, sorry. I only just took it off today. Um, so this has crowned me already. It's like a lovely glitter. I mean, this is not going to do it justice. There's actually, the pieces of glitter in this are so big that they actually look like sequins, obviously, Miss Universe sequins. So again, let's see if you can see that. Then that's it for the nail polish. And then my last item that I've got here is a facial cleansing brush because um, I've, I've seen that everybody has been uh, doing the, um, has got Clarisonics, but in Australia the Clarisonic is like three, four hundred dollars and I mean this is two ninety five. <laughs> so I don't know how many you would go through these in a year, but it's got to be cheaper for me than the Clarisonic. And I mean what if I bought the Clarisonic and I didn't even like it because I have very sensitive skin and um, I have Rosa Shea which shows up quite a bit so just thought I'd try that one and that's it for all my makeup products today and if you like any questions about the products that I've purchased or if you'd like to subscribe to my channel then please do and until next time happy shopping